Under sunny skies in downtown Painesville, the International Food Festival is taking place. People are soaking up the sun and trying all different kinds of cuisine. But for one couple, it's a place to serve a sentence. Well, you know, breaking the law is breaking the law no matter how you look at it. And, um, you know, Judge Ticanetti, if I wasn't in the pool today, I'd, I'd probably be giving him a hand for creativity. You want it to be um, both a punishment and a learning experience for him. Painesville Municipal Judge Michael Ciccinetti is known for his unique punishments. You guys like a uh, life jacket pamphlet? You Here's what they did to be sentenced this way. Bruce Crawford and his girlfriend Grace Nash recently went out for a trip on the Grand River. Crawford didn't have a license for his raft and neither one of them wore a life vest. A park ranger asked if it was their raft and they said no. The ranger thought someone was missing and called in search and rescue teams. The Coast Guard from Detroit even sent a helicopter, but no one was ever missing. The raft was theirs. Part of their punishment was to stand in this kiddie pool today and hand out water safety pamphlets. Kathy McAdams was at the food fest and she says she likes what the judge dishes out. I think it's effective. I think it's different. I think that um, I think they're not going to do it again. Bruce and Grace still have 100 hours of community service and a year of probation, or they could still go to jail. What's the lesson here? Don't go on the river without life jackets or a registered boat, and don't lie to the authorities. In Painesville, Mark Durdek, News Channel 5.